Sicilian defense, open, Nadorf, main line, 10.G4H6. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed Black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game was messy, but White got the better of it. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The c pawn in the Sicilian defense controls the d4 square. Nf3 moves the knight toward the center in anticipation of a pawn push on d4, where it will be ready to retake the piece if black captures on d4. When black eventually plays nf6, white is prevented from moving the piece to e5 by the opening of the light squared bishop on d6. d4 offers to trade the d-pawn for the c-pawn, giving up a center pawn for more active pieces. cxd4 provides black two key pawns while giving white only one. nxd4 recaptures the pawn and activates the knight in return for having one central pawn versus black's two central pawns. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the undefended e4 pawn. Nc3 defends the e4 pawn and starts to develop on the queen side. A6 prepares the queen side pawn advance b7 b5, and also prevents white from playing the bishop or knight to b5. Bg5 puts immediate threatens the knight on f6, white may castle queen side after developing the queen. E6 controls the important d5 and f5 squares and allows the dark squared bishop to develop to e7. f4 gains space in the center, controls the e5 square, and prepares to develop the queen to f3 behind the f pawn. Nbd7 develops the knight toward the center and defends the knight on f6. Qf3 develops the queen to a central square and prepares queenside castling. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling queenside tends to be more active because the rook is closer to the center. By doing this, a queen moves off of its beginning square and into the action. g4 takes space on the king side and allows white to fianchetto the light squared bishop to g2. A pawn kicks the opposing bishop, forcing it to move or risk being captured. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is the last book move. This doubles the pawns, weakening the pawn structure. It is a mistake. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This misses a chance to advance a rook from its starting square. It is incorrect. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. This reveals a rook attack. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. From a prior move, recaptures. That's good. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This prevents a queen on the other side from checking. That's good. This misses a great but hard to find move. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is a mistake. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. This took advantage of a bad move and black is no longer in a losing position. This prevents the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is a great move. That's a decent move. That's good. This misses a chance to advance a rook from its starting square. It is incorrect. That was a truly amazing move. This is the only move that works. This threatens to play checkmate. It is brilliant. The knight that was attacking is now gone. It is ideal. The pawn is now adequately defended. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This moves away from the queen of checking. It is ideal. There was only one good move in that position. This misses an opportunity to win a bishop. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is a miss. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. The queen is therefore moved to safety. It is ideal. This prevents a queen on the other side from checking. 
it is ideal. This wins a bishop. This threatens to win a bishop. It is best. This misses a fantastic but elusive move. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it? It is incorrect. This poses a checkmate threat. That falls flat. Very precise. It is best. While not the greatest course of action, this is an intriguing alternative. It is quite good. Recaptures. It is ideal. This overlooks a better way to develop a bishop off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This provides a free pawn. It is a mistake. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is quite good. The knight is now located at an outpost, a safe area inside the enemy's territory. It is ideal. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This gains a king. It is quite good. This avoids the queen's check. It is ideal. This is the way to win a queen. This threatens to play checkmate. It is best. Thus, a forced checkmate is possible. It is incorrect. This forces an eventual checkmate. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game was messy, but white got the better of it.